Next thing we know, all we start hearing is boom, 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 boom. Oh. I'm talking about it's just gunshots everywhere. Oh. So me and my sister, we take off running through the house. We're like, oh, God, they shooting at us. We done pulled out the stove. And got behind the stove. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame you. I ain't, I ain't we hid behind the stove until the shooting died down, y'all. Yeah. I'm not going to lie to y'all. To this day, that is the funniest story I ever encountered in my <laughs> life, y'all. Because as a kid, in my mind, I'm thinking, like, they going to kill us. My mama not here. Uh, what's, what's up, up incredible, incredible fam? fam? Welcome back to another episode of The, the Incredible, Incredible Scots. On tonight's episode, y'all, we are on day four of Childhood Struggle, Struggle Meals. Meals. We got, you guessed it, Spam. Spam. Uh, Daddy has two sandwiches. Y'all already know your girl's a vegetarian, so I wasn't finna fool with the Spam. Um, but Daddy got two Spam sandwiches and some plain, uh, what is this? Plain chips, lays, wavy chips, whatever. Um, I ran it on back with the uh, with the ramen noodles, and I got some onions off up in there. I'm gonna put some hot peppers up in there, and I got some of my homemade jalapenos. Uh, I wanted to take it all the way back, old school. So we got some Gatorade in pickle jars. Y'all know when y'all was <laughs> y'all know when y'all was kids when you ran out of glasses you used pickle, pickle jars. jars for Kool Aid. Okay, so y'all already know what the deal is. If this is your first time visiting our channel, welcome to the Incredible Fam. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the bell to be notified every single time we do what drop a video. And make sure that you tell somebody to tell somebody that the Scots are doing big things right here on our channel. We're getting ready to get into this intro so we can get into our food. Check the intro. Sit back and learn in the heads about the time. Matter of fact, subscribe. Hit that bell, be notified. You're officially rocking with incredible Scots. Go ahead and tell somebody to tell somebody. Go ahead and tell somebody to tell somebody. Go ahead and tell somebody to tell somebody that you're officially rocking with incredible skies. Oh. oh, oh. All right, y'all. We are back and we are ready to get into this food. Uh, your girl, I'm starving. Y'all already know how that goes. So we getting ready to say grace so we can go ahead on and get into this good old delectable food. Father God, we thank you for this food as we're about to receive it for the nourishment of our bodies. For Christ's sake, amen. All right. Now, I'm going to tell y'all a little secret. Daddy is not a big fan of Spam. So let's see how he likes it. Mmm, it's good. You like it? Mm-hmm. With the cheese and them. Oh, yeah, with that cheese on there. Yeah, it's real good. And now I got a secret for you. I didn't think I was, because, you know, I haven't had Spam since, I don't know, since I can't tell y'all when. I got a secret for you. What? That's vegan cheese. We oh. we ran out of regular cheese, so it's I had to good. use vegan cheese. He couldn't tell at first. Mm -mm. I couldn't even tell it was vegan cheese until she said something. I didn't know. It's still good. Don't still eat it. <laughs> All right, y'all. How was your day? Happy, what day will y'all get this video? What's the day? Monday. All right. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. Um, what y'all been up to? Today was a pretty easy day for me. I just worked a few hours. Zion is still under the weather a little bit, so she and I laying down and chilling or whatever. Nope. Yep. Happy Tuesday, Incredible Fam. Mm -hmm. That Spam is good. So, this is Turkey Spam, but the Spam that he has is the regular one. Because I had found uh, the regular Spam at first, and then I found the Turkey Spam, so I didn't know which one he would want, so I got both of them. I'm sorry. I got the regular Spam. The regular Spam. Y'all, let me tell y'all something about I'm this. 
Them noodles look good. You sold too much. These noodles are bomb. Noodles look good. I don't know how it's gonna go with these jalapenos because when I make my homemade jalapenos, some of them in the jar be like really, really hot, and some of them in the jar be like really, really mild. So I don't know which ones is which. They be strong too. I be smelling them all through the house. <laughs> I be like, man, them jalapenos be strong. All right. You want to start us off with a throwback story from your childhood? Y'all, I had an uncle that was a character. <laughs> I mean, he was a character. I mean, one night I was uh, I was asleep. I had to been about maybe about eight, eight or nine years old. And we talking about Uncle Scotty. Uh huh. And you know, rest in peace to my uncle Scotty, Scotty Rock. But I remember when I was eight years old. Uh, I was asleep on the couch. I wasn't asleep, really, because I was still peeping under the blanket, watching everything that goes on. No, so, Z. my mom sitting there, my auntie, they, you know, they got their little drinks or whatever. They, they tipsy and all that. And my uncle come downstairs with a with uh, his wife. He had got one of his wife wigs, and he came downstairs with a wig and with a little dress. Over uh his you know he put a, he put one of her dresses on, and he came downstairs he grabbed the mop and he was dancing with the mop. <laughs> he was doing some kind of dance mode, and I was trying not to laugh because I didn't want to get in trouble because I was supposed to have been asleep. But I mean they with my mom and my auntie boy they was bugging up. And that sounds like Uncle Scotty because he's a character. Oh, he's a character. My uncle was a character. Like back in when he was younger. In his younger days, oh man, he was a character. Like man, like one time he had um, my mom had a uh, what you call them things? The uh, they get older people they get around a scooter, electric chair, the electric scooter, electric. No, it was a electric chair, a scooter. The, the electric chair is what you get put in. When no, no, no. When you get executed, my bad, my bad. No, not that, not that. It's an electric scooter. Yeah, electric, my mom had an electric scooter. You know, because, you know, my mom couldn't really get around like that. You know, she started getting a little, you know, older and, you know. But anyway, my uncle, my uncle, Scotty Rock, used to take her electric chair. And he, I mean, he cruising all, hitting the, hitting around the blocks, hitting the liquor store in an electric chair. He'd get out with his little shades on. And he'd park put, it like a car. And he'll park the electric chair like he was in the car. <laughs> Ooh, man. I don't talk about man. I could I could really man, I could do a movie of my uncle because he was a character, man. Funny dude to be around. Cool, man. He was a character. He was a character, man. Super cool. Well, mm -hmm. I guess my childhood story would be. I'm not sure where my mama went, but if my sister get on here, she will know, and she'll be cracking up. I'm not sure where my mom went, but I know at the time, now I have five brothers and sisters. It's six of us all together. But at the time, my two baby brothers, they weren't born yet. It was just the four oldest of us. So I'm not sure why she took the boys with her and left me and my sister at home, but it was just me and my sister at home. I don't know where my mama went, but it was New Year's Eve. So me and my sister, uh, my it was they had y'all remember them? Uh, it's a ham steak and it got mm. a bone in the middle of it. Oh, I remember those. Mm -hmm. My sister had fried up some of them ham steaks for us and we was eating on those or whatever. So and y'all, it got to be twelve o'clock. Next thing we know, all we start hearing is boom, 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 boom. boom. I'm talking about it's just gunshots everywhere. Oh wow! Now mind you, we're children. My sister probably was like maybe twelve, and I probably was like five. If if that, my sister might have been like eleven, and I was probably like four. But anyways, we were super duper young. So mind you, we're not putting two and two together that it's New Year's Eve and it's twelve o'clock. <laughs> so that's why they're shooting. Mm -hmm. So me and my sister, we take off running through the house. We're like, oh, God, they shooting at us. We done pulled out the stove 
and got behind the stove. <laughs> I don't blame you. I ain't lying. We hid behind the stove until the shooting died down, y'all. Yeah. I'm not going to lie to y'all. To this day, that is the funniest story I ever encountered in my life, <laughs> y'all. Because as a kid, in my mind, I'm thinking, like, they going to kill us. My mama not here. Oh, we man. got to hide. And my sister not putting two and two together because she a kid herself. Mm. Child, look. We were so far behind that. Look, I don't know how we were strong enough with Jim because my sister always was really, really skinny as a kid. Like, she was, like, so skinny. She was wearing size zeros and ones. That's how small she was. But I can't tell you for the life of me how her little bitty tail and my little five-year-old tail pulled that stove out. But we did. Y'all got that stove. Y'all got behind that stove. Man. Okay. I remember one time. This had to have been about, oh, this is a long time ago. This is my dad. Now, my uncle was a character, but my dad was a character too. Mm -hmm. And I think my dad was a little bit worse. A little bit? He was a lot, lot worse than my uncle was. I mean, both of them were some characters. Don't get me wrong. But my dad was this, I mean, my dad was wild. Like he was wild when he was in his younger days. Oh yeah, he was wild. And so uh, it was on a. It wasn't New Year's. It was like around the Fourth of July. And they started popping firecrackers and fireworks and what they called the little uh, the little rockets. Uh, the little uh, they Not like firecrack dynamite. School name, so you don't. Uh uh. Yeah. Dyn dynamite. Dynamite. It was one of them things. No, not not that. Uh, it was Look, like, it was like a firecracker. He tripped me talking about electric chairs and dynamites. He trying to kill somebody. No, no, no. Look, it was like a. Uh, what would they call them things? They real loud, like boom. A Roman candle. Not not those. You talk about the little. It was a cherry balls. The little cherry balls. That what you remember? But they it was a, it was a name for them. A M eight. Uh uh uh. uh I, but anyway, I was scared they, of was, they was loud. So, they were still popping fire fireworks or whatever. And it was around like maybe about 2 o'clock in the morning. It was late. Everybody in the bed, except for my cousin. One of my cousins, you know, they used to stay out all night or come in anytime they want to. But I'm laying down. Everybody else laying down. My auntie and her uh, husband, they, in, they, they sleep. My dad crawling through the house. He the only one crawling through the house. Oh, they shooting. Somebody get, y'all get down, get down, stay down. So my auntie, you know, my auntie, once she wake up, once somebody wake her up, she will snap. Like my auntie did not play. When it came to her getting her rest, when she got woke up out of her sleep, she will snap. So my auntie bust out the door and my dad, they call my dad Mac. That's his name, Mac. She was like, Mac. You better shut up or you won't get out of my house. <laughs> so my dad, my dad be like, okay, okay, sis, okay, okay. So he, you know, he crawling through the house. He really thought my dad was really thought that they was out there shooting and stuff. Like he was tripping, my dad was tripping that night. That's Mac. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's Mac attack. Mac attack. <laughs> Y'all, let me tell y'all something about these uh, jalapeno. They the bomb. They look good. Now, how could you? I couldn't eat them just like, just eat them like plain, not plain, eat. but like regular. Just eat them. It's that little sour taste there. Oh, so good. I guess the vinegar. It's the vinegar. It's all, but you know what? It's, in your childhood days, it's always that one in every family. Like that uncle, cousin that's, that's just wild. Not like going around robbing people. Not that type of wild. Not, you know, fighting and all that stuff. But, you know, like they was just, they did like weird stuff. Crazy. Like, yeah. Like stuff that be like, I can't tell y'all. I got too many family members that watch my entire channel. <laughs> I can't tell y'all the crazy one in our family, but he was crazy. 
you would be like, what the world is wrong with him? <laughs> but if anybody know my family, anybody on here that knows my family or if you in my family, I have the funniest family you can oh, ever. Oh, yeah, buddy. My family is some straight characters, man. They funny. Straight characters. Keep you bugging up. It's always a blast with my family. Man. I'm talking about from the oldest to the youngest. Everybody. Oh, yeah. And they very sociable, so you can't be, you know. <laughs> but they real cool people. Yeah. They real oh, yeah. cool. Always having some type of get together. Yeah. And always singing. Oh man, they love it runs in your family. They love to sing. Always. So what did y'all think of um uh, this little skin? I can't take it. Oh, I got skin on. Mm -hmm. Oh, I didn't know that. What did y'all think of the um uh, what was the name of that game? Um Guess, Guess what movie? Guess what movie? Or get it wasn't a movie. Scoot in so you can just say. Guess the restaurant or whatever it was, child. Food. It was uh Guess the Food. Guess that food. I think we did Daddy food. was cheating. No. Mm hmm I had like I had nine. And you try to say I had seven. But I think at first I had seven. You did have I seven up, when I said you had seven, but you got two more after that. And then I end up getting two more. Yep. And so I had nine. Wow. To your what? 20? 18? <laughs> 24. Oh, wow. 24 to nine. Yeah, she told me up I in that game. I told her to your left. She told me We going to play it again. He oh, yeah. wants his rematch. Yeah, but rematch. Oh, yeah. We I ain't going to lie. I'm going to tell y'all who a beast in that game. Zion. Mm -hmm. Zion is a beast in that game. You sure lives. I be like, how you know all that? Cause me and her went, we um went over it yesterday. She got all of them right, every last one of them right. Yeah, Zion a beast in that game. Well, actually, well, she probably, of course, because she the one that showed us the game. Mm-hmm. I thought she was gonna come in the video tonight, but she ain't feeling. She ain't feeling too well. She been asleep ever since we've been ever since we've been gone. Like in the car, you know, we've been out. She been asleep. Lay she back. She's in there now, laying down. I don't know if she went back to sleep or not. This is her stomach. She eating a little more. Mm hmm. She getting better. Cause like. at first she wasn't eating at all. My mm -hmm. baby had lost like five pounds in like two days. Wow. Cause she would not eat at all. When she ate her food yesterday and her soup. I said, so that's a, that's a good sign. She's she doing getting a, little a little better. better. But I'm going to tell y'all, if y'all get the flu or any type of sickness, you ain't even got to be sick. Take that black elderberry. I'm oh, telling yeah. you, that stuff worked like that. They better sure it was what, $20? $15.99. Almost $15.99. Sure, $16, sure, $16, it better work. We getting ready to do, um, uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it. What's that? The put the fire out challenge. Oh. Oh. I can do it as far as it being hot because I'm cool with hot stuff. But these noodles got me full, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it. Uh, and on top of that, y'all, we been we went around. It's Marquise Hilson, uh, put the fire out challenge. But you oh, do it. Yeah. You do it with flaming hot lays, y'all. We went around to probably about five or six stores and looking for lays and no, could not find no nope. flaming hot lays. So I end up having to get flaming hot ruffles. Yep. We could not find no flaming hot lays worth nothing. We've been to Dollar General. We've been to Hy-Vee. We've been to Walmart. Uh, 
Now I did. Walgreens. Uh -huh. Walgreens. I did find them, at, and we went to the corner store. Mm. I did find them at Walgreens. I mean, not Walgreens at a uh, Walmart, but they had like the variety bags, the one that cost seven dollars, and it was only two in each variety bag. So that would have meant for both of us to get two bags a piece. I would have had to buy two of them big variety bags, and ain't nobody mm -hmm. around me finna eat them hot chips like that. Mm -hmm. So, so I ain't. Cause you know I'm not too big on hot. Now Zion is, but I don't let her eat hot chips like that. Every now and then. You know Zion to tear them chips up. Mm -hmm. Them hot, she love mm -hmm. hot chips. That child love them hot chips. She wanted to do to put the fire out, child. Yeah. She showed uh, them hot chips. We done been about the show. We couldn't find no uh, flaming hot legs worth nothing. I said, oh man. Until I, I seen them ruffles, I said, well, I called you and I said, well, you want to go with the ruffles? I don't know if it's just a Springfield thing or. Oh Lord. Mm. Yeah, I don't know if it's just a Springfield thing or if it's just that they ain't as popular as they used to be. Cause they used to be very popular, but now they got flaming hot Cheetos and uh, flaming hot fries and flaming hot onion rings. And I don't be seeing the uh, lays no more. Mm -mm. They didn't have none of the lays. Yeah, them noodles was bomb as I don't know what. This spam was good. Them sandwiches was fire. Yeah, that was, that spam was good. I ain't think I was gonna be able to like it, but it's good. And I ate it with vegan cheese. <laughs> and couldn't even tell it was You ain't even vegan. put no mustard on it, did you? You said, you said it was mustard on it. I ain't put no mustard on you it. You didn't? I ain't, I ain't even nothing. need nothing but cheese on it. I that. ain't put nothing but cheese. So Baby. Just the cheese by itself. That was it. I'm gonna wake up. About 2 o'clock in the morning, the stomach gonna be bubbling from me. Oh, them jalapenos. I forgot about that. <laughs> You're going to have the bubble guts. <clears throat> the BG. <laughs> the bubble guts. <laughs> if y'all haven't already, make sure y'all go and follow us on Instagram at official underscore incredible Scots. And today we just started a um uh we just started um a Facebook page. So go make sure y'all like us on there as well. Cause like we said on Thursdays we go live on Facebook and do um trivia. Trivia night where one person wins a um one person wins a cash out prize or whatever. And last week we did a bonus round where uh somebody won a second cash out prize. And guess it was the same person won twice in a row. But she was on that thing. She was on it. Yeah. Oh yeah. She worked for her cash out. She showed sure did. She wasn't playing. So y'all go check us out on that trivia, man. Come on in our uh Facebook page. And win some cash, man. Play that game and, and, you know, get them cash apps, man. You can find us on Facebook at The Incredible Scots. Same way it is Incredible on Scots. Incredible Scots. Yep. Anyways, y'all, we got one more video to do. Um, So, we hope that you guys enjoyed hanging out with us today. Um, We had an amazing time hanging out with y'all for day four of childhood struggle, struggle meals. Y'all already know what the deal is. If this is y'all first time visiting my channel, welcome to the Incredible Fam. Make sure y'all hit the subscribe button. Make sure y'all hit the bell to be notified every single time we drop a video. And make sure that you tell somebody. To tell somebody. To tell somebody. That the Scots are doing big things right here on our channel. We absolutely positively love you guys so very much.